CBC News has confirmed that Ottawa police have charged former Conservative Senator Don Meredith with sexual assault. Meredith faces three counts of sexual assault and one count of criminal harassment. Now, these charges relate to the alleged events that took place in 2013 and 2014, which were first reported by an adult woman. The police have released Meredith after charging him, and there is no word yet of a court date. Now, remember that Meredith resigned from the Senate in 2017 following allegations of his and revelations, quite frankly, about his two-year-long relationship with a teenage girl. CBC's Idil Musa is following the story for us and joins us now. Idil, we've been noting that Meredith is facing some serious charges. Remind us, how did we get here? Yeah, so you know, um, you know, as you mentioned, these are very, very serious charges, three counts of sexual assault and one count of uh, criminal harassment. Ottawa police say uh, the charges were laid after an investigation uh, that was made uh, into these allegations. They were made by a woman. They say that the incidents date back to 2013 and 2014. And Natasha, Ottawa police have confirmed to CBC that the alleged victim was an adult at that time. Meredith, as you mentioned, has been released now on a promise to appear in court. And so Meredith has faced accusations of inappropriate behavior in the past. What's happened then? Yeah, so just to, uh, to remind people, uh, Meredith, who was a Pentecostal minister, was appointed to the Senate by former Prime Minister Stephen Harper, and he served in that role from 2010 to 2017. 2017 is when he resigned and he did so as his peers were preparing to expel him. That's following a Senate ethics uh, uh, report that found that Meredith had had an inappropriate relationship with a teenage girl. A subsequent Senate ethics report also found that he engaged in behavior that constituted harassment and sexual harassment in the workplace. Now, in 2020, Senate paid nearly half a million dollars uh, to nine former employees in compensation who say they suffered that harassment and, uh, sexu and from sexual uh, harassment in the workplace. And also, Meredith is eligible to collect his parliamentary pension because he resigned before he was expelled. CBC has reached out to him for comment. He has not yet provided one. Okay, CBC's Ithil Musa in Toronto. Thank you so much.